Hi, I have in front of me a 50 watt outdoor LED floodlight with an IR sensor on it. Basically what it means is uh, you have the equivalent of a 500 watt halogen uh, light and the IR sensor on it simply means that you can set it up to detect motion and come on just exactly when you need it for the period you can specify on the light itself. So some of the key uh, specifications on it, it's IP65 which means it's suitable for indoor and outdoor use. Um, what attracts people to LED obviously is the fact that the huge energy savings, but the fact that, um, uh, that it comes with a 40,000 hour warranty on the LED itself means that it's going to be incredibly low maintenance. Indeed, Manhattan are giving a full five year warranty on all of the floodlights that they're selling. It comes with uh, uh, aluminium casting here, so once again, it's um, minimizing the chances of any type of wear. And one of the very clever um, design changes Manhattan have over their competitors are, instead of having screws in the front, they have them at the back. So that can normally be a weak point for uh, wear and things like that, but mounting it this way minimizes um, any risk in that aspect. Um, in terms of the beam angle on it, it's 120 degrees. Um, and uh, you know, so it's obviously a very, very powerful light. Uh, if we look at the base here, this is where the little IR is on it. Uh, so we can see here that we have full rotation over and in terms of the vertical here as well. Okay, so there's three adjustments on the bottom of it here. So you're able to adjust for both uh, the sensitivity in terms of picking up motion, the time, the time period you come on for, whether it be 10 seconds up to 10 minutes, and also you have a look setting on it where you're adjusting for the type of light in which you want it to come on. So obviously during the daytime you probably don't want to come on at all, but you want to come on at dusk or at later darkness, really what you're trying to adjust there. If we look at the back of the unit here, we can see there's a very substantial bracket for mounting it. Just adjust it here. And also there's a lead here on the base, and it's one meter long. You can just see the tree cables being exposed there. Um, so it's relatively straightforward for installing. And uh, we can see the presentation box that's coming in here. I'll just rotate it, this is probably the best angle for it. So we can see it here. And there's a user manual that comes with it as well. It just gives an overview of the actual uh, installation, etc. In terms of the overall product range, it's running from about 10 watts up to 120 watt. Um, obviously, the, the smaller sizes are more popular, but we do stock the full range, so we can cover both just commercial, uh, light industrial, and all up the all the way up to heavy industrial usage. Um, uh, so, uh, and we have the IR version and the non-IR version on uh, most units. Uh, in terms of why we went with Manhattan, well, there's a number of reasons for it. The first thing, is it's a, a very recognized brand name and somebody that we have very good experience with in terms of their overall products that they sell. Uh, the second thing to note on it is the price point that it comes in at is very, very competitive. Uh, even some of the low-cost ones, they don't have anything in terms of the same specification or warranty periods on them. Uh, they're coming in very competitive uh, towards them. Uh, and also, both the, the design of the quality and the range of the products that are stocking, obviously, it's very attractive to us as well. And it's made this one of the more popular products within the electrical section on freetv.ie.